Good afternoon and welcome to Linstock. Today I'm just a short distance away from Carlisle um, on the road to Brampton to show you a fantastic property called Linstock House. Now it's this substantial property here which dates back to around the 1800s. It's been extended over the years to create a fantastic family home and has got lots to offer you. We sit in a plot of around half an acre. We've got lots of parking to the front that you'll see in a few minutes. And we've also got the benefit of a recently converted coach house which has created two um, two bedroom living accommodation spaces which is perfect if you're looking for maybe an extended family to live here or maybe you want to generate an income with a rental property so there's two of those completely converted and beautiful there's a lot to show you in this video so I'm going to spin the camera around quite quickly to take you back out to the front show the street scene and then we'll go from there but this is a substantial six or seven bedroomed house depending on how you wish to configure it we've got around five reception rooms we've got ample space it's super location and very very close to Carlisle so please keep on watching Okay, so I've just brought you to the front to show the street scene. So you can see we're on a quiet road within the village. We've got um, access down to a number of other properties, but Linstock House sits behind this sweeping driveway here. So we've got gates leading up to the property and look at the substantial size of it. It's a really attractive and beautiful building. It also has benefit of parking and um, the outbuilding here. So the garage space and the coach house I made reference to at the start of the video is just over here. So there is, um, they've had planning permission granted. They've done the conversion and you've got two fantastic two bedroom cottages within that space with an area of garden which could be just about here we've also got another courtyard to the back you can see a glimpse where there's some parking there so there's another access point again you'll see that towards the end of the video because we do have quite a lot to show you here but this is Linstock House. What a handsome looking property and what a beautiful front door. So we're going to go in and show you the internal space first of all. Then we're going to come out the back door and I'm going to take you around and show you the cottages and then we'll touch on the garden at the end of the video. Okay so let's go inside and you'll see what this beautiful home can offer you. So as we come in the first part of the house, we've got an entrance vestibule with a nice tiled floor here. And then we come through into this really quite grand um, entrance hallway where we've got a sweeping staircase taking us up to the first floor. And you can start to see an element of the proportions here. So great size entrance hallway. To the right hand side, we've got one of a number of reception rooms. And this has got some fantastic dual um, windows um, with different aspects, a lovely wood burning stove and um, just fantastic views. We touched on the views a few minutes ago, but we've got open views from here across to the Pennines, which you can't quite see today. And from upstairs, you'll see there's views um, across to the Lake District Fells. But look at the scale and the proportions in this room. We've got a beautiful marble fireplace. We've got nice window casing, lovely wooden flooring and plenty of space for some really stylish bits of furniture. Then as we come across, we'll look at reception room number two. And again, this has got some great proportions. So we've got um, we've got UPVZ windows in here because this home isn't listed. Nice fireplace, um, fantastic proportions again, with features like the ornate cornicing and the ceiling rows as well. So um, that's reception room number two. Then as we go down the hallway, we're going to just miss that door for a second. It'll come clear towards um, the next part of the video. Just down this way, we've got um, to the left, we've got a downstairs loo, which is in here. And we've got a room which has been utilised by the current owners as a gym, but this has got flexible use. So if you're looking for a playroom or working from home space, it really could be anything at all, this room. And then the heart of the home so the kitchen is just through here to the right this doorway here takes us into just a storage cupboard and then the kitchen we've got this fantastic space here so a real real beautiful um yet traditional um but modern and stylish there's so many words i could use to describe this kitchen it's fantastic it really is the heart of the home with a large island unit nice fitted cabinetry which is all bespoke it's all handmade and the central space here which has got a dual-sided fireplace which leads us through into the dining room so just to take in the space this is the kitchen a fantastic space for family living then as we come through um, one of two sides to the fireplace, this is a nice dining area, which has been used by the current owners as a snug. You can see the other side to that fireplace there. And again, fantastic proportions, lovely features. And the doorway here goes back into the hallway. So this is another room in itself. 
And then with a recent addition of the conservatory to the rear, this is where you really start to see the scale of um, the view. It's like a 180 degree view across, across your garden space across the open countryside and again to those fells just in the distance there but coming back around look at this lovely lantern light roof ample space for a really large table and um, so perfect place for a large family <coughs> and then doors out on either side so we've got a doorway here in the center and out to the left hand side and then coming back through the opening into the kitchen so a really, really beautiful and heart of the home kitchen space. There is another door through here, which we'll see towards the end of the video, because I want to take you back out into the hallway and go up to the first floor. There's lots and lots to see here. So then as we come back into the hallway and up the staircase, we lead up to a turn in the stairs where there's this impressive arch window. It's absolutely beautiful and up onto the first floor landing. Now from here, we've got a number of rooms. So if we go to the right hand side, first of all, this is one of the bedrooms, great size proportions, good size double room. And we look down onto the road, which gave us access into the driveways here. Then back out onto the landing, we have Bedroom number two, which again is a fantastic size room. And we've got nice views out onto the driveway here. Down the hallway, we've got bedroom number three, which is a nice single room. Um, but again, great use for a family. And we're looking down onto the driveway parking. But as you can see throughout this house, we've got some fantastic high ceilings. This floor is really nice to mention as well. Then we've got the family bathroom. So this is recently added and very, very stylish, a beautiful bathroom with a bath, with a shower over, nice warm for rainfall shower and some stylish paintwork and nice um, hand basin there in keeping with the age of the property. So then we've got bedroom number four, which is the master bedroom. And this again has had a recently added shower room and hand basin unit fitted. So this creates a bit of a suite. We've got some great dual aspect windows, lots of space for some large furniture. But with the addition of the hand basins and the shower, which are very, very stylish, this makes this room, um, it just takes it to another level, which is really beautiful. And the current owners screen that off from the room, which is great. And as you can see here, we're now looking down onto the gardens and we'll have the Lake District Fells in this direction over here. So a beautiful bedroom, but there's more. These bedrooms just keep on coming. This is a fantastic home. Um, so as we keep going round, we've got another bedroom in here, which has got a nice fireplace, some great, great spaces. And then... Lastly, another bedroom. So you can start to see the proportions aren't compromised here at all. We do have a single bedroom, but these are the big bedrooms really make up for that. Um, again, nice ceiling height, lovely views out to the front and to the rear. And this room has also got the benefit of an ensuite, which is super. So we've got um, a nice walking shower there and a modern and stylish um, decor in there. So lots of bedrooms um, and we do just keep on going. So we're now, because of the age of the property, we're coming to a back staircase, which takes us down. And at the turn in the stairs, we've got a cupboard in here, which has been used as a study, but also a bedroom. So this is a great space um, that you could potentially use if you wanted to create some annexed um, accommodation here. So um, just remember this room for a few minutes because we've got a bedroom here and then coming back down the staircase, we have a snug room, which is absolutely beautiful, nice oak flooring, lovely panelling and some, um, some designer wallpaper there, creating this snug room, which could have independent access going out to the courtyard to the rear, making this maybe a self-contained unit with um, a lounge, a bedroom up the stairs and this doorway taking us back through into the kitchen 
like this. So maybe you're looking for a relative to come and live with you, or if you're looking for somewhere for teenagers to have their own independent access with their own bedroom, then this is a space that would work fantastically well. So from that point, we then just come back into the kitchen space here, and I'm now going to take you out to the rear to show you the coach house cottages and the parking spaces to the back which um, are again, again, another great addition to this home. So we'll just go out this door here to the courtyard. Okay, so I've just come out of the back door here, which takes us through into the kitchen. Um, and then this is the rear courtyard. So you can see here, this um, current family, they've got quite a large family and a number of vehicles. So you've got ample parking here for some, some large spaces. And we've got a little courtyard there. But as I extend down to show you um, the coach house um, cottages, you can see here that if you were to use these to generate an income or if you have a large family, you've got plenty of space here, ample parking. And I'm just going to take you, before we go into the cottage, I'm going to take you down and just show you the other access points. So we're back on the same lane as we started off. The other access down into Linstock House is just down here. And then this is the access to the back. So let's go inside and have a little look in one of the cottages. Um, both are very, very similar. So we're going to go inside this one today. This one here is due to be completed in the next couple of weeks, but they're both very similar and finished off to a similar standard. So as we come into the first of the two coach houses, um, we've got um, a reverse style living accommodation so this is one of the bedrooms you can see we've got that nice coach house style window here space for furniture and a good size double bedroom um, and we've got some fantastic proportions so the left hand side we've got another bedroom or a flexible use depending on what you want to use the space for because we do have a doorway here which goes out to space that could be allocated to this cottage as um, a garden space that we saw a few minutes ago then we've got a bathroom and you can see everything's been finished off to a really high standard nice bath with a shower board and then a glass shower screen nice vanity unit in the bathroom there and then coming up onto the first floor this is where we really start to get quite interesting so this space is vast look at this if you had this as a rental or if you had this for multi-generational living if you had a parent or um, a independent teenager that wanted to live here it'd be superb you've got some exposed stone you've got the beams you've got the nice arch windows but then mixed with a contemporary feel kitchen and um, lovely work surface and lots of cabinets so this is a great space nice open plan living kitchen area and next door is virtually a carbon copy of that space. So you can generate income from this house. So you can live with a number of family members and really um, just have a space where you can all live together. So that was quite a lot to show you. We've shown you the house, the garden, the coach house, um, the grounds. It is a really beautiful proposition for somebody. If you're looking to generate an income from the coach house cottages, or if you're looking for multi-generational living or as an extension to your main home, then this is perfect. Please do give us a call on 01768 881111. We'll be happy to give you more information about the stock house.